Upgrading the RAM, also called memory, on your laptop, PC, and small form factor systems is a quick and easy way to speed up nearly everything you do on your computer. Here's how it's done. Before you begin, there are a couple things to keep in mind. Make sure the memory you have is compatible with your system. Kingston.com has a handy online tool to help you easily find which memory is compatible with your computer. Next, your work surface should be clean and you should ground yourself first by touching an unpainted metal surface to prevent damage to any components. For most upgradable laptop PCs, a simple Phillips head screwdriver is the only tool you'll need. First, unplug the computer and then unscrew the bottom base. Now remove the battery. Press the power button after the battery is removed. Find where the memory is located. Sometimes it'll be identified on the underside of your computer, otherwise you'll need to consult your computer manufacturer's manual before you begin. Carefully push the metal clips on both sides of the memory module outwards to release the first memory module. You'll notice it pops up slightly. If you're installing two memory modules, do the same with the second module as well. This can sometimes be found next to or even underneath the first memory module you removed. When installing the new memory, it's important to notice the alignment notch on the memory that lines up with the notch of the memory slot on your computer. If it doesn't line up, flip it around. Slide the memory module at a roughly 45 degree angle, but don't force it in. The memory will fit snugly into place with light but firm pressure. Once it's in place, press down on the outside edges until you hear the clips on the sides snap into place, letting you know that the memory is secure. If you're adding more than one, repeat this process for the other memory. Then reconnect the battery and screw the bottom base into place, and turn on your computer. On some systems, your computer may alert you that the amount of memory has changed. Don't worry, just enter the BIOS and accept the changes. And that's it. If you have any questions or need additional help to install memory on your computer, be sure to visit www.kingston.com/support for more information. Thanks for watching.